I rarely use materials and textures in my SketchUp files. You can see here that the default colors are basic in my models. While these materials and textures are critical features for many SketchUp users, I usually avoid making hardware and wood look more realistic in my models. I'm anxious to leave the computer with clean dimension drawings and get into the shop where a pretty picture is just not that helpful. Recently, however, I found myself looking for a better look for my model of a simple kitchen paper towel holder. I wanted that paper towel roll to look like it really is, not just a bare cylinder. So I copied that bare cylinder down to the on the right axis, on the red axis, and and then created a sm small plate, a face, on which I'll paste an image. And I bring, I make this plate rectangle just the height of the of the roll of the paper towel roll. I took a picture with the iPhone of a flat flat piece of paper towel and here is that image and I'm using as an image to bring that photo into SketchUp and paste it on the on the rectangular plate and bring it up to the full height and right click on that face and use as, as material and that places the image into the materials dialog box which we'll see here in a minute. I'm editing the cylinder and going to the materials dialog box and picking the image and pasting on the outer circumference of the roll. Now I've got something that looks better to me in a simple thing to, to do.